Salam, I hope you guys are well. Halal Chef is back for another video. Halal Chef presents. Our delicious beef and jalapeno loaded fries. Turn up the heat on medium, here with a touch of oil. Or when the pan is nice and hot, I'm gonna throw in the meatball. And you wanna smash that. You're gonna get a nice crust on that. Season with a light touch of salt and black pepper. Let this cook for around two minutes and then we're gonna turn it. All right, bismillah, scrape that off. Got a beautiful sear on that. Yes. Now while that's getting brown, I'm gonna throw in our onions. Spring onion whites. Our garlic. Now break down that beef and really cook this mixture. And I'm gonna throw in some of the chopped red chili or finely chopped jalapenos. And again, let this cook for another minute. And finally season generously with some of this beef seasoning. It smells so good in the kitchen, trust me. One of the best beef and jalapeno fries that you're gonna try. Mix in some of the American cheese. Turn off the heat and leave it covered for a few seconds. Let's check this. The cheese is beautifully melted. I'm just gonna mix this slightly. Amazing. I'm gonna grab your crispy fries, season with a good touch of salt and some of this hot seasoning. Now remove the fries onto there. Some of the chipotle mayonnaise. Our cheesy beef mixture goes on the top. Load it up properly. I'm going to add some more jalapenos onto there. Some more of this chipotle mayonnaise. A bit more seasoning. And finally garnish over some of these spring onions. Our delicious beef and jalapeno loaded fries. Flawless victory. Done. They look amazing. For our spicy queso cheese fries, we're gonna start with our queso cheese sauce first. Tomatoes, onions, some garlic. Here I've got some mature cheddar. I'm also gonna use some of the American cheese. Here I've got some of the fajita seasoning. We go ahead some of the jalapenos, evaporated milk. You could also have some of the spring onions and garnish with some of the coriander. Now right, let's cook our queso cheese sauce. Turn the heater on medium. Here with the butter. And a light touch of oil so the butter won't burn. When nice and not throwing your onions and the garlic. Give that a mix and you want to lightly saute this. I'm not throwing the tomatoes. You want to soften up those tomatoes as well. Now with your fajita spices. With a good touch of that. And just toss that around and cook the rawness of the spices. It with evaporated milk. Give that a really good mix and you want to bring this to simmer. Now once it starts to simmer, turn the heat to low and you want to mix in the cheddar cheese. And the American cheese as well. And you want to turn off the heat and give that a really good mix. Now have a little taste of the sauce and adjust any seasoning if you need to. Mm. That is so delicious. And finally you want to mix in the jalapenos. Now you can also garnish it with some of the fresh coriander if you like. And now let's make our spicy queso cheese fries. Here with your crispy fries. Season with a good pinch of salt and some of the fajita seasoning. Now remove your seasoned fries onto your plate. Add the queso cheese sauce all over the top. Add some of these jalapenos, peppers, and some of these red onions. And finally a bit more seasoning on the top. And some of these dried herbs of a mouth-watering queso cheese fries. Flawless victory. Done. They look amazing. And for the tandoori fries, with the yogurt. A quick mix to that to make it nice and smooth. And with the fresh mayonnaise, you could also use bernays instead. Some of this hot sauce for more flavor. And with the tandoori marinade, you could cook this before adding it in, but I like the raw taste of it. Pickle juice, so you could use a bit of lemon. Just to add a bit of freshness into it. And finally, you want to season it with a light pinch of salt and pepper. Now give this a really good mix of our amazing tandoori sauce. Done. Grab a pan and a touch of oil. Here with your peppers, onions and spring onions. 
you want to lightly saute these and with some of our tandoori marinade and with your cooked fries season with a light pinch of salt and some of this tandoori masala mix and combine everything just turn off the heat at this point all right let's load up our fries and with the tandoori chicken add a few slices of cheese and you want to melt that and I add some of the garlic mayonnaise onto there of our amazing tandoori sauce some of these spring onions and finally some parsley of our delicious loaded tandoori chicken fries Fatality. done of our amazing animal fries and with the mayonnaise and with the mustard a good touch of ketchup to add a bit of sweetness some of this pickle juice to add some acidity or you could use vinegar a good splash of Worcester sauce for a bit of heat I'm using hot sauce and with a freshly grated garlic now the garlic can be too strong so don't use too much and with a finely chopped gherkins and some of this pickled red chili and now you want to season with some paprika, salt, pepper and finally some parsley now give that a really good mix and combine everything of a mouth watering sauce Done. For our animal fries, we're gonna start by caramelizing the onions. Now grab yourself a pan and turn the heat to low medium. Give it a knobs of butter. Touch a foil to stop the butter from burning. And with your onions. Give that a really good mix and cook those onions. So you want to let them cook on low medium heat and stir now and then until caramelized. Use a touch of water to deglaze if required. Add a good pinch of salt in there and some of this brown sugar it will help with a bit of that caramelization and add a bit more taste so this is exactly what we're looking for at this point of time I'm just gonna turn off the heat and let's assemble our animal fries I'm using a curly fries they will be able to hold our ingredients much better make sure to season them generously with a touch of salt, pepper any of your favorite seasoning and slices of cheese on the top and now you want to melt the cheese Once you've melted the cheese, you want to throw in your caramelized onions. I add our amazing sauce on the top. Be generous. Some more onions on the top. And finally, I'm going to garnish it with some of these spring onions and chives. And a bit more seasoning on the top of amazing animal fries. Brutality. Done. They look amazing. Sweet and spicy pickle fries, here with the mayonnaise, of course. Here with our spicy sauce. So the squeeze of fresh lemon juice add a bit more tang to it. Here with the dried oregano and parsley for more aroma and flavor. And finally touch of black pepper and salt. Give that a really good mix. Have a little taste. That is so delicious. Of our amazing spicy mayonnaise. Done. Now for the fries, I'm gonna make this honey mustard sauce. Here with the mayonnaise, yellow mustard. Here with the honey, some freshly ground black pepper. Good pinch of salt. A little bit of smoked paprika. A light touch of this white vinegar, you could use lime juice. Here with the fresh chives, they're gonna add a bit more flavor into it. Good mix to that. Have a little taste. Mmm, that is amazing. Our delicious honey mustard sauce. Done. All right, let's prep the fries, add them into a bowl. Some of this Cajun seasoning. A little bit of the spicy mayonnaise. All right, remove your fries onto there. A bit more spicy mayonnaise. A drizzle of this honey mustard, some of this melted cheddar cheese. Now throw in the pickles. Now you could also add some of the jalapenos onto there. Finally a bit more sauces onto there. I'm gonna garnish it with some of this pickled red cabbage. And some of these fresh chives. Be generous with the chives, all right? Oh man, these fries look absolutely amazing. You guys gonna absolutely love this. <laughs> Let's start with sweet and spicy fries first. Bismillah. Mmm, wow, those are so so delicious. The amazing flavor from the pickles, the cheese, everything goes very well together. All oh, this victory. Mmm, wow, I'm lost for words, trust me. Please do me a favor and like this video and share with your family and friends so they can enjoy as well. Alright guys, thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Make subscribe, make sure like. Inshallah, see you next time. Until then, salam. Make for your mom, make for your dad. Make for your family and joy.